Hello guys, welcome to our live reaction to One Piece chapter 1074, which is called Mark Free. So, how are you doing, man? Ah, oh, pretty good. Pretty good, thanks for asking. How about you? Fine, as always. So, this time I'm also one chapter behind. <laughs> <laughs> so, we need to catch up. So, it's carnival time in our town, so... There was not a lot of time to read anything. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> Just party a whole week, non-stop. Um, Alright. So, we got a nice cover story here. Um, a flashback of Queen, Caesar and Judge fighting. Three men endlessly scraping to be number two. <laughs> so, basically, they were looking forward they were looking up to Vegapunk, right? Yeah. So they respected him. I think they still respect him. Yeah, oh. he ha he has an unfair advantage though, like having the the brain brain fruit. Yeah. They can't catch up. <laughs> no way. Yeah. That's true, yeah. Okay. You want to go? Yeah, sounds good. All right. So, oh, Fabrio Stratum, Eckhart. Wait, did we say the, the title of the chapter yet? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay, good. <laughs> Wasn't sure. Just so people don't get confused. All right. Fabrio Stratum, Eckhart. A figure blocks their way. You're meant to be with the Marines, right? Why the hell is a government weapon getting in our way? You'll pay for hurting our man. And we see some goon trying to attack Kuma. And Kuma... That's not cool. Wait, no, not that's not. Yeah, I just wanted to say there's the pacifista emblem on him on on his chest. What is that? <clears throat> okay. Ah, and he's. Wait, what is he using? Is yeah, he using... what is that? Is he using fishman karate, like water or? Uh, that could. What? Well, it's your page, so. It's a bubble. Sh it's a bubble shield. The ultimate defense. Invented by Vegapunk. This must be a Mark III Pacifista. It's far more advanced than the prototypes used in the Summit War. Pacif Navy Science Group Weapon Pacifista. Okay. Um, resistance is futile. Surrender and proceed uh, with me to Factory B. It's a PX3. Mark III. Okay. Um, everyone, do what, uh, do what it says if you don't want to die. Okay, so not only, not only the Zero thing, but also... I also thought that Peak Zero... Yeah, Peak Zero is Kuma. But I mm -hmm. thought that Peaks One is like the second strongest to Kuma. But apparently it goes the other way. One, two, three. Four, yeah. But it's interesting that they... Uh, well, 41. But wait a second. Peak Three. Yeah, it's on his chest. So it three yeah. is the... The mark free. So yeah, you're right. It goes the other way. So the higher the number, the, yeah. the stronger they are, I guess. <clears throat> but didn't wait? Didn't like um, at the beginning of the time skip in Shabon the Archipelago? Didn't like Sentomaru attack Luffy with, like with a peak seven? Or was that just the name of the pacifista? Well, they have a number beneath it too, like zero forty one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's probably it. That's the serious number. It was, I think uh, it was P seven, no, which attacked, uh, which attacked Luffy. Yeah. Okay, but anyway. Well, if it was seven, it was probably. I think the you know zero zero seven P X one zero zero seven or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. I, ca I can't imagine it being peak seven when they say, "Oh, it's no. <laughs> Mark three and that's strong." Yeah. True. <clears throat> okay. But, but who's who's controlling him? Pacifista don't act on their own like this. Initiating capture. <laughs> Fa and we're back to the factory. Please don't move. You'll aggravate our uh, your wounds. Huff huff. Some day, of this turned out uh, wait sorry half half someday of this turned out to be are the pacifists doing their job 
Something's definitely up. The Frontier Dome's sealed, and I can't even get a hold of Grandpa Punk. You got it. I'll get him off the island, no matter what. Yeah, I think he trusts Luffy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he, d he doesn't like it that he needs to trust him, but I think he trusts him. Um, this is really bugging me. We can't get a signal because the Navy is jamming communications with all this constant static. Guess we really are rebels now. <laughs> Guess I can just do whatever I want now. All 50 Mark III units stand ready to tip the block. Oh, shit. <laughs> Sent tomorrow is... Oh, it's sending out all 50 of them. Yep. You know what that means, right? War against the government. No, all 50 of them will oh. strike back because of the Gorosei. That might be, yeah. Uh... This is suicide, uh, what Setomaru is doing there. He doesn't know that the Gorosei is coming, but this is basically suicide now. <laughs> Yeah, maybe. Eckhart, Eckhart is dead. <coughs> but the island is done. When Gorosei well, sends the attack back. We we already know that, because they're basically already initiating a buster call. Is that a buster call, right? No, no, they in initiated a buster call. I'm pretty sure. Really? I think they just sent out Kisaru. But they didn't say anything about a Buster Call. But it basically is, yeah, but it, <laughs> they didn't say the name Buster Call. I think Usopp was stressing out about it. I'm not yeah, sure. Yeah, but... It, it, they don't know Kisaru is coming. They have no idea. Mm. It's just sent tomorrow now, where we get some marine signals that something is coming up. But yeah. they have no idea. They're just assuming it, yeah. Vegapunk knows they want him dead, so... I think he's, yeah, but... he's basically already kind of seen the possibility of a Buster Call. Yeah, yeah, but they don't know who is coming right now. Especially a Gorosei. Yeah. Okay. Right. Straw Hat Luffy will be, taken, uh, uh, will be taking Dr. Vegapunk with him on his ship. Your mission is to see to it that they set sail safe. Understood. The Navy might have something up their sleeve. Stand guard at the coast. Uh, st yeah, yeah, something up their sleeve. That is Saturn. Mm, we'll see. And stop moving. Let us out of here. Something's going to go down on this island soon. No matter what happens. You must ensure your creator escapes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Labostratum Egghead. Uh, what do you mean he's not here? He's got to be in the lab somewhere. Uh, I ran all over the place looking, uh, looking though. Luffy broke his hover boot, so he had to run everywhere instead. <laughs> Don't snitch, I can't pay them back. <laughs> 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 but seriously, where did Applegrams go? I couldn't find Bonnie either. Uh, Bonnie's over here. Huh? Everything in the lab is transmitted to the monitor. She never hmm. went anywhere. You could have told me sooner. So, wait. So... I couldn't find Bonnie. Bonnie's over here. She never went anywhere. So she's probably just looking, it's just still looking at the memory. Yeah. But where is Vegapunk? That's a big question. Okay. Double page. Okay, and ooh, nice double page for me. All right, let's see. This place is simply marvelous. They have everything. The future is now. <laughs> I thought we were leaving. <laughs> we see Brooke and Sora with the future gear on. The Stussy is like basically a straw head. <laughs> yes, I think Stussy is less of a straw head and more of a bigger punk. Yeah, yeah, there yeah. We go. Where's your Stella body? Did something happen? Uh, yes, we have a couple of issues. Brace yourself for this. First, the Stella has disappeared. Second, we've lost control of the Frontier Dome. 
What? How can that be? Pant, hey, your face is as good as new. Pant, we found some spare parts. <laughs> oh yeah, they repaired, um, what's her name again? Atlas. Uh, Atlas, right. Thanks. Man, I need a chart for this. Um, all right. As things stand, we're basically trapped on the Labo Stratum. Seriously? If we try to leave, the lasers would likely fry us. Why would they fry them? Couldn't he just make them not activate when he he or the Stryads go through? <laughs> what? How can we leave the island on Vega, uh, with Vegapunk then? Quite, and the dome is really a secondary concern when you consider you, uh, your main passenger is missing. We should prioritize finding the Stella first. I'll figure out a way to repair the dome in the meantime. Oh, so it's it's broken? Is that it? The, the, the thing is, the thing is, is that a traitor? I don't know. Because, re because remember when... Um, the control, the, the the Frontier Dome just got deactivated, so mm -hmm. Cypherpol could easily fly up there. Yeah. And then they activated and break now it. The, so now the cameras are, are going out, one after another. Well, not only Stirf. that, but uh, keep in mind that once everybody was inside, mysteriously it broke. Yeah. They, they're just... They're just keeping them in place so nobody can flee. They can they can eradicate them. That kind of throws up the question if Stussy is a double agent. Or triple agent. Or triple agent, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but how could she she's with them right now? Mm-hmm. Okay, well, these this place do normally show the entire lab, but it's Sarah from Rampage just now. Okay, the cameras are just going out because of the Rampage. Uh, must have incapacitated some of the baby monitor snails. Or maybe they were just knocked out of position. Okay. I'm having our workers and the other satellites search for him. He might have passed out in a blind spot. Shaka, it's Pythagoras. The third floor of building C seems empty. I see the next try the next try what? the sooner we find him the sooner we can uh, we can set sail let's go search I'll join you for treasure too <laughs> I'll also take a look around I'm worried Lady Stussy take me with me take me <laughs> with you <laughs> okay <All right. laughs> Sanchi's <laughs> happy about the new um <laughs> Female uh, company there. All right. Um, <laughs> guess I'll hand a la uh, I'll lend a hand. We're looking for a geezer uh, with a sawed-off hat, right? <laughs> Sora wait, Sanchi, wants to train Sanchi. the search. If Sanchi knows what she looks like in fifty years, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I think I think he he would uh, he would have more of an issue of her being a clone or, you know, judges technology than anything else at this point. An issue? He even likes Minx. I mean, yeah, <laughs> Minx. Minx are Minx, but, you know, this is tied to his past, so I don't know about that. Yeah, anyway, I guess I'll lend a hand. We're looking for a geezer with a sawed-off hat, right? Hold up, Mosshead. You're going to f you're you're going out to find someone, but who's gonna find you when you're done? <laughs> He's right, Sorrow. You stay. Just be a deer and wait. Okay, <laughs> man. Even even Robin joins in. <laughs> man, what a pain. Well, they're just forming a search party, so I guess I'll uh, they'll be fine. Anyway, you mustn't. Uh, you must have been running all out, huh? Huff, huff, blah. I always go all out for everything. I can't believe we bumped into these guys again. Oh, and the, on the picture we see, like, Zoro and, and Luffy just basically chilling on the couch with um, yeah, Luchi yeah. And, and, and Kaku <laughs> lying in front of them. <laughs> just, damn, not giving a damn. 
<laughs> That's funny. Takes me back to Water 7. I wonder how Ice Boss is doing. Lab interior, paw room. Bunny, don't touch that. Shut it. Get out of here. Wah. And so, sh yeah, it's your huff. page. Huff, huff, sob, sob. Oh, it's Kuma. What's, uh, flashback finally? Yup. What's wrong? Hey, sniff. Wait, daddy? Come here. Ah, oh, someone save me. I can't take it anymore. We've got you now. Bastard, get your, get your ass back now. If you escape, they'll kill the rest of us. I don't want to go back. Slaves? Mm, no. They're if you escape, they kill the rest <clears throat> of us. Oh, yeah, that could be. That could be slaves. You're right. I wasn't sure. Like, you could have been already a government thing. A government experiment. I don't yeah. ever want to go there again, so... What good's crying gonna do? Damn brat! What the? I can't get any closer. Yeah, because it's a memory. Go back. Just kill me instead. If I go back, I'll die anyways. What? And they start whacking him. Damn. Stop. It hurts. I'm sorry. And yeah, it is the celestial dragons. We see the hairdo. Stop it. Help me. It hurts. I'm sorry. Save me. Please stop it. And Bonnie can't take it and gets thrown back from the memory. Wait, wait. Wait, that's Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, after the chapter, I need to talk about this page. Um, huff, huff, and she's out. Okay. Yeah, we and see Mar Kuma, Mary Kuma Joa. still climbing. By the way. No, 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 no. I'll t I'll the castle stuff, later. dude. Come on. I get to it later. I get to it later. Um, half half, and he's still climbing up to Marishoa. But Follow Kuma is still going. Shoot him down. Half half. Okay, I I I I'll say it now. Yeah. Go he's ahead. in he's in a he's in a grass field, right? Yep. Well, there is some kind of castle, and there are celestial dragons, and they have slaves there. But the grass field, I don't think that's Marishoa. I think that's God Valley. Okay, mm that could be. Not against how that. Old, how, how old is Kuma? Wait, 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 wait. I have to look this up. Kuma what? He could be old enough. Please tell me that Kuma's flashback will tie into the God Valley incident. Wait, but follow me, Kuma. Uh, wait. Kuma One Piece H. How? He's... <laughs> He's 45. The God Valley incident was 38 years ago. So he could have, yeah, he could have been in there. Seven years old. What if the Kuma flashback will end with the whole war between Garb, Roger, Rocks, and all of them hmm. on God Valley? And that's how he escaped. Well, we know. Just for... throwing it out there. Just throwing it out there. Well, we know for sure that Celestial Dragons are involved, so we'll see. <clears throat> That's the only thing we have right now. Yeah, the grass field. It's the grass field that was cutting me off there. Yeah, maybe. All right, okay, so sorry. no worries. <clears throat> but he's still in the room. I can take it all in. My resolve wasn't strong enough, but... If I stay ignorant, I'll never be able to understand, right, Dad? She goes in again for <clears throat> for another memory. All right. Wow, uh, they really totaled the place, even though they were born here. Uh, Stella, where did you get to? Hmm? Clank and kaboom! Yeah. 
So one of the... There is tanks. a traitor! Yeah. Clink. No clink. Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> um, Kuahaha, get a... <laughs> Where are we going now? The news clip? Morgan, what? Yeah. Get a load of this. An insane scoop <clears throat> just came in. The world government intends to assassinate the beloved Dr. Vegapunk. They plan to kill the world's greatest... How does he know? Stussy. Gotta be Stussy, right? Well, they know each other. Mm. Could be. They well, plan to kill the world's greatest genius. It's like O'Hara all over again. Yeah, literally. <laughs> <laughs> but they have miscalculated yeah. this time. The good doctor is far too popular for this to fly. He's loved as the man that develops energy to light up towns the world over. He literally knows everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fortunately, guess who else happens to be on the scene? This guy. <laughs> so let's make the headline. Navy engagement... Navy engagement... Oh, okay. there's no space. At Akhat. Emperor Strawhead Luffy takes Vegapunk hostage. <laughs> I'm sure the government will appreciate that spin. Go collect their contribution. <laughs> yes. Nice. That's outrageous. Oh, Jesus mm. Christ. What the heck? Vivi is there? No With way. Wapol. Yeah, I mean, I don't give a damn about Vapol, but Vivi is no, there. No, we knew. The last time we saw Morgans, Vapol was calling in that he has some news. Yeah, but... You know, I mean, what the heck? I get Vapo, but I don't... What the heck? Like, damn. <laughs> Luffy-san would never do something like that. The economic journal, uh, journal is such a rag. <laughs> she actually borrowed my clothes. I'm never watching them again. <laughs> Fangirl in the background. <laughs> Keep your voice down. What if there's a wiretap snail around here? The government will erase us. King of evil black drum, Vapo. Besides, Mork Chun took us in. Don't be rude. Hm. Big talk for a girl who, who was bawling her eyes out yesterday. Don't look down on me or tell me how to do my job. My words can shake the world. Besides, news isn't about facts or fiction. It's about entertainment. <laughs> How information flies. One Piece, <laughs> chapter 1074, end. Dude! Wapul saw the whole thing. Don't you think? Yeah, he knows. He's just totally afraid at this point. What if there's a wipe that the, the government will erase her? He totally saved Vivi. Yeah. Maybe he ate her, and that's how he saved her. You know what I think? He did that as... As a, you know, as uh, I think uh, Cobra told him to do so. That's why he did it. That's the hint from, you know, uh, do you remember the yeah. reverie where Cobra was scolding Vapo? I think Vapo has a, has huge respect for him, so I think that's what, what happened. Yeah. Oh, this is wild. So, they're probably... Sabo, <laughs> Vivi, mm -hmm. Kuma, maybe, who saw Emu. Mm -hmm. Any who, any anybody else? Well, Cobra's dead. Um, maybe Bonnie, mm -hmm. because she saw Sabo, right? <clears throat> I think so. You know what? I think... <clears throat> Sorry about that. You know how uh, Oda really put a lot of weight on the Alabasta? Yeah. I think there could be the parallel that Vivi... You know, like like when, when she met the Straw Hats, she told them the story about Crocodile. And they, they've never seen Crocodile. And they went in just trusting her. I think that that will be the parallel. Like the foreshadowing to Vivi will get back to Straw Hats meet up with them and ask them to take down Emu and tell him the story. Yeah.
Okay, this, this was a good chapter. Yep. <laughs> um, <clears throat> thing is, there's still a, a traitor there. Um, is it Shaka himself? I mean, the Act, acting like the monitors are going wild, and um, I. I know where Bonnie is, and I saw her the whole time, so you were, like, running around aimlessly. It could be him, because, first of all, he's logic. So he could be like, if I let them kill every Vegapunk and cut a deal, I could survive. Yeah, maybe he just activated some kind of bomb there in this corridor, because he was... Wait, he was telling Pythagoras to go somewhere, right? Yeah. Next, I see the next try, and we don't know what he told him. But he lured him there. No, I think that happens in the same frame, basically. He tells him, like, he gets cut off there, you see. Like, I, I see the next try. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. true. We don't know if... Well, he sent him there, yeah. And he tells him where where it's empty. I think he's trying to get him back to... Uh, get him to repair something. Oh, but, yeah, but he was talking after this. He was running around. Where did the Stella go? So he, the bomb didn't explode when Shaka was talking to him. It was after this. Yeah. And we, we, but Oda, Oda is like showing us that so, somebody's behind him. Yeah, we see clink clank, and he's like, hmm, and then it happens. So yeah, the, the clink clank could tell us that it's a robot. Yeah, or the shoes behind him. Is there another robot between them? Atlas, right? But yeah, she got, she gets fixed up right now. It can't be here, right? It could be. Wait, where is uh, what's her name? The one who uh, Lilith. It She? Yeah, but yeah, yeah, could be. She wants to shoot stuff down, and she's not anywhere in the double spread. Yeah. Or, no, I don't see her. Is, is there, York is in the, okay, York is in the spread. Yeah. Atlas in the, is in the spread. Um, Cypherpole is in the spread. Uh, the little guy, what's he called? Edison. Edison. Edison is in the spread. So it has to be either Shaka controlling everything right now. Or Lilith. Or, or Lilith. I don't know if Shaka would have the time with everybody around. Yeah, and Usopp is watching him. Yeah. So if so something would be fishy, he'd, he'd point it out. Yeah. yeah okay. I think it's, it, it could be Lilith, to be honest. Because she wants, she wants like, stuff to, to go down. Yeah, but why? To test her weapons? I don't know. Isn't she like the... killing them all? <laughs> Wait, isn't she? <sighs> Let me think. What what was her? Evil. Evil. She's the evil. Yeah. Yeah, but but wouldn't it be too obvious? <laughs> what if he wants us to think that? <laughs> yeah, it could be. <laughs> Reverse psychology. <laughs> yeah, I give this chapter an eight or a nine out of ten, somewhere between. Yeah. It's an 8. It's a good chapter. Um, the VV reveal and the Vapo reveal puts it up again. Yeah. It puts it near to a 9 for me. 8.5. Because that Vapo is probably one of the people who saw Emu. <laughs> did, did they all got sent away by Kuma? That's the question. Mm. Be because how did they escape Marishoa? When they saw Emu. Yeah, it but. It had to be Kuma slapping them all away. But Kuma also got out, so. It, yeah, he can slap himself. 
Yeah. He slept pro probably in the end. He slept himself with the revolutionaries away back to Dragon. Mm. But there is no other way they could have escaped. Paul Morgans was really coming in with the no. Hmm. I'm the so. No. All right. So yeah, my final one is eight point five out of ten. Um, good chapter. One left. Mm -hmm. Want to separate them? Yeah, sure. All right. All right. So, question of question for this chapter: Who's the traitor? If there's a traitor. That's a good one. Yeah. Guys, who do you think who is the traitor? Put it on in the comments, and we'll see you for ten seventy-five. Yeah. Oh, my guess is it's Buggy. Emperor Buggy is there. Already there with the... <laughs> he kills them kill. off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> By the way, I saw good. If I got, uh, I saw good theory on cross guild, because Weevil just got snatched up by Real Kugyu. Um, the theory is that because he would be out of the story and it wouldn't make sense mm. that cross guild comes in and saves him so there's one more world they got one warlord more one ex warlord yeah it makes sense yeah okay guys thanks for watching mm -hmm. and see you for the next chapter and final chapter yep bye guys bye bye